From left to right, we have Tyson Carter, Nick Weatherspoon, and Abdul Adu. You can go ahead and questions. Tyson, how does it feel to finally get one in a win column against Alabama? Feel good. Um, we was just talking about that when we were that dumb. Like, we got to go ahead and um, go and beat those guys. Mm -hmm. Nick, you seem to hear recently really be coming on out there and things. Did you change any part of your game or here recently to, to be more – I guess have more points on the stat sheet and things here here lately and things. You've obviously been active defensively and things, but did anything change for you to become more assertive offensively? I would say uh, the main thing, the confidence, and I've been using my pull-up jumper a lot and I want you to pull up, so that's one of the main things I've been using. I, I haven't been using my speed a lot, so I've been using my speed a lot to get to the rim, and I'm strong enough to finish a lot of these plays, so that's what I've been using a lot, my pull-up jumper. Give your credit with your defense, uh, Inside for a lot one of these that took a lot of threes. What were y'all able to do to, to defend that and force them into making some bad shots? Um, we knew that they didn't have a lot of shooters on the floor. We knew uh, Petty was really their main shooter, so we kind of sagged off 12 and number 10, and all those guys, and make them make shots. So we really just helping on Sexton a lot and just make him make the other guys make plays. So we kind of sagged off them and make them shoot three. <clears throat> the guys that can't really just shoot as well as he could. Tyson, back on Alabama, obviously, they've kind of been a thorn in the outside, and the same thing with Georgia. What's it like from a mental standpoint to, to get over the hump and be able to beat those two teams? Can you move the mic? Can you answer? Can you answer with the mic? Hey. Just to get over that mental hump of beating Alabama and Georgia. Yeah, um, we just we knew that we've been playing good lately. Uh, we've been winning because of our defense. We've really been guarding people. But we came to this game with a lot of confidence. And uh, like you said, they've been beating us, and that made us that made us just even go harder because we knew we, we didn't want to keep losing to them. Hey, Abdul, how, how has this team become a better rebounding team lately? Um, we, take, we take everything personal, you know, rebounds, scoring, defense, you know. Um, um, one thing we do best right now is we block out, you know, the whole five guys from the one to the five. We all block out on defense, and then the three, four, and five. We always try to crash as by on the offensive end, which we really do a good job of lately. Nick, it seemed like the crowd kind of gave you guys a lift when you needed them late defensively. What was kind of your opinion of the crowd? Uh, I mean, our crowd it was real well, especially in the second half. We know uh, a lot of teams play uh, better at home because of the crowd and. Them just lifting us up, um, it helped us out a lot, just made us want to defend more. So our crowd was great to know. Nick, how do you describe this win? You guys played it just a couple of weeks ago over in Tuscaloosa and got back within distance, but now to finally beat Alabama. Well, how, how big of a win is this for you guys, uh, especially now as you head on the road this weekend? Uh, we made a couple of adjustments, um, like with some of the switches or some of the guys, and um, we just memorized like with some of the things they did. and. We knew they was coming in here very confident that they can beat us, and this win it means a lot to us. I mean, this this game we've been talking about before the season, so it's very big for us to just get this win on here. Nick, how's y'all's confidence changed since that first Alabama game? Because this is probably a game that a few weeks ago it seems like you guys weren't able to close out. In the last couple, two or three weeks now, it seems like you guys are closing out. Has, has the mentality, I guess, changed a little bit? I mean, yeah, you know, a lot of it has to do with it's a crazy conference. Like, some of the team we beat, beat them. So we know if that the team that we beat to beat them and we know we're good enough to beat them. So that's some of the things we look at and some of the things we see we messed up on on film. We know we're gonna do better than this so we did better than that this game and we was able to close it out. Last question.